And it was just recently announced that the last three months were the warmest on record across the globe. Uh, so uh, even though we avoided a lot of that very high summer heat, we still felt plenty of it over the last couple months, even when temperatures were just a little above average day by day. We're now looking at a switch in the season, so to speak. We had some cooler air come through early this morning. Another trailing weak cold front coming through now. That has kicked up a few thunderstorms in southern Wisconsin. We'll keep an eye on those. But ultimately, we see a lot of cooler weather was flowing in uh, over the rest of the night and over the next couple days. It was just a day ago that we were about 10 degrees above average. Near average today, if not slightly cooler than where we typically are for this time of year. And then nearly 10 degrees below average starting tomorrow. So we switch from... Uh, definitely a lot of summer heat to almost a preview of later this month and into early October, at least for a day or two. Starting to feel some of those temperatures right now. Upper 60s in a few spots like Rockford at 69 degrees, low 70s elsewhere. Not often that we see the lake shore where those cooler waters influence the air temperature. Uh, 81 in Waukegan right now. That's all ahead of that uh, push of colder air, but it's going to catch up with a lot of spots that are still seeing some summer heat. And we'll see the temperatures stay just like this uh, as we go into tomorrow. About the rainfall, we've had some drizzly conditions on and off this afternoon. Not much on exact track radar, but like I mentioned, we're keeping an eye on a few thunderstorms north of Janesville right now. We'll have to see if they manage to sneak on through our backyard later this afternoon. Uh, but for the most part, we've had fairly dry conditions and much cooler weather uh, to deal with over the rest of this evening. Sticking at about 70 the next couple hours might rise ever so briefly close to sunset, but then we're definitely dropping again as we go into tonight and tomorrow. Tomorrow. Down to 64 tonight under a mainly cloudy sky and then really don't warm up much going into tomorrow afternoon. Most spots staying below 70 degrees. Uh, so again, that's nearly 10 degrees below average for this time of year. We do look mainly cloudy and dry all throughout the remainder of the day. And it won't be just for tomorrow uh, through next week. Likely staying cooler than average. Our chances are up to 50 60 percent across a lot of the Midwest. So we zoom in closer to home uh, right, right at that cutoff between about 50 to 50 plus percent chance for cooler than average weather sticking around over the next six to 10 days. Uh, so all that summer heat may be out of the forecast for a little while. So the results here are upper 60s for tomorrow. We do get back to the upper 70s under a bright sunny sky Friday through Sunday. So that's uh, pretty typical weather for this time of year. So we do get back to around average. Then we may drop again into early next week. Those upper 60s could return with some rain showers. So more often than not, fall weathers here to stay for a little while.